Uh, hello everybody and welcome back to some FTB University 116. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. I am. So, uh, you'll notice our tree farm is a mess. Uh, I shut it off. Uh, we've got this thing just about all the way full. Uh, until I can get some more storage for it, uh, or fix the storage for it. That's where it's at. Uh, but we're not going to worry about that today. What are we going to do today? Well, today we are going to work on getting us uh, some more power going. We're going to dive into a bit of mechanism uh, more than we already have, which wasn't very much. Um, so, I want to get uh, some wind generators made up. These guys uh, at Y200 will produce 384 FE a tick. Uh, if we could do... 10 of them. I'd like to do 20 of them. Uh, love to, please don't spam these. Uh, yeah, we're going to spam them. Uh, if we could do 10, that would be great. If we could do 20, we wouldn't have to worry about power for a little while and I could start getting everything else set up that we needed to go. So, that is what we're going to work towards. Uh, we're going to need a few things before we get to that point. Uh, to make these guys, they're not hard to make. Uh, we need that and that and that. We need a bunch of osmium, a bunch of iron, uh, a bunch of gold, uh, and a bunch of osmium. We've got all the above. Gold, where our issue is going to wind up being in making a ton of these. That in time. Oh, it's going to take a while to do all this stuff. Matter of fact, let's go ahead and get this up. So, but, uh... In order to do this uh, a little bit more, uh, we're going to make these guys here. So we're going to need to make us an enrichment chamber. Shouldn't be that hard. We've got steel now. Uh, steel. Uh, we're going to need some iron. We're going to need some of our osmium. And we're going to need some redstone. And we're going to make this guy just a simple fact of so we can do this uh, with the enriched items instead uh, just to make life a bit easier I need some glass so um, this guy here we got that uh, so power wise uh, reason why I did go ahead uh, and put lava on top here because we're gonna be getting rid of this pretty soon and one thing I forget uh, is, and I was told, and I don't remember who it was told me, I have to look. Uh, but we can put, we can log, uh, log well, I was going to say water log, lava log, uh, the pipes now. So we get an extra side to it. This guy's producing, I think it's like 300, um, no, it's 160 after you tick. Uh, but these guys are full uh, since we haven't been using any power. Uh, so we need one, two, three, four, and one, two. No, we want two of those and four of these. All right, we got those, and now we can make our enrichment chamber. Beautiful. Uh, that didn't give us... Why did that not give us a quest? That should be a quest. Uh, osmium compressor. Um, there we go. Now we got the quest complete. Uh, these guys, we can just go ahead and hit. Uh, we're going to learn how to do all these. We're going to need a lot of stuff. Uh, a lot. Um, while we're doing this. Alright, let's do that. Let's throw... Let's go ahead and get a stack of redstone. And we'll throw this in here. And we'll talk about some of this stuff. So, we've, we've looked at the singularities. Um, we're going to look, okay, iron singularity. We need 10,000 of these to do the, uh, 10,000 iron to do a singularity. We are going to need, uh, a bunch of these singularities. Uh, to do these guys, we need four of those, four for that, four for that. We're going to need, you know, the, the iron, the, the ultimate singularities. We're going to have to get a lot of stuff to do this. But this is the one that I was looking at. Uh, we've got uh, overloaded in here. And in order to get the armor, I need nine times compressed block of iron. Yeah. Uh, we're going to need, like I said, we're going to need a lot of items. So, um, 
And I forgot where I was going with all that. Anyways. Yeah, that's what we, we were talking about there. Anyways. But yeah, we're going to need... Uh, yeah, I got lost in all of that. Um, we were just thinking, we were just talking about the... Oh, we were just talking about the number of items that we were going to need. Um, I wish there was a way we could change some spawners around. Um, we will look into... I, I have to look into some of that. Um, we've got, I do believe, capturing enchantments. Um, let's see here. No. But we do have mob shot. We got loot. We got that. Uh, but yeah. Uh, power is going to be the big thing. And that's what we're doing today. I'm just mumbling. Alright. So, I do have, uh, we've got, what, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 of these guys made. These together will produce just about 5,000 RF a tick if we put them up high enough. So, first things first. I want to get us... I need some osmium. Uh, we need some, uh, at least a little bit of power storage. Uh, we're getting some power storage with... Uh, we've lost all of our osmium. Uh, osmium. Um, we get some power storage with our dimensional cells. Uh, it's not a whole lot. Uh, this will give us a little bit of a backup when we've got stuff going on. So we're going to make this guy here. And I need a bunch of these. That's not going to be nowhere near enough. There we go. There is a basic energy cube. This will hold 1.6. Uh, I think we can go all the way to here, which is the Elite, which will hold 25 million, and that should give us power storage enough for what we need to do. So, I need to do some more crafting of stuff. I bet. And, here we go. We've got our, uh, no... Dang it. Not yet. Alright. Now we should have what we need to do this. Uh, I had to go do some iron fetching. Or not iron fetching, but gold fetching. Uh, we still need one more piece of iron. Uh, that's our, Or not iron, but gold. Uh, that's easy enough. We got some more there. Uh, yeah, we've run out of gold. Uh, which I figured we would wind up doing. Uh, so this guy, that guy, there we go. We've got this guy ready to go. Uh, it'll hold 25.6 million FE. We are going to need another dimensional cell. Um, so let's get, do I have any blue dye left? It does not look like it. We're going to need redstone we've got. Uh, we're going to need a couple of these. And we've got iron. So this guy uh, we need some gold nuggets. Some blue dye. So that. Um, another diamond and four quarts. And that should take care of what we need. I thought I got a diamond. Uh, Alright, so. Basically the way we're going to set this up is. I am going to. Go up top. We need a couple of. These guys too. Uh, so I need eight gold nuggets. We've got the redstone, and then I just need some paper, which we should have some of. Uh, so we're going to go up to Y200, and we're going to place these guys down. Uh, and then we're going to run them downstairs with a dimensional cell. Uh, and then use the Elite Energy Cube down here um, as our storage. That way I can keep an eye on it and see what we've got. So... I am going to get all this set up. Clean out my inventory because, good lord, we've got the stuff. Uh, and get all of this going. Uh, plus, I need a bunch of blocks. To fill our way up in the air. 
Uh, we're going to need 120. That's enough. Plus some of those. That's enough. Uh, before I forget, I need to make some of these here uh, pipes. We don't have enough pipes for this. Or not pipes, but uh, what did I do with the steel? It's right there. Redstone. And I should have some more stuff down here going. So, I need this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Three. We'll go ahead and upgrade those to the next tier. And beautiful. That'll hold a bunch of uh, power, too. All right, let me get this built. All right, so we've got these guys up here. It's ready to go. We've got our new power cell card. Uh, these guys are all running nice. These guys are actually already full. So is this guy. These guys are all holding a bunch of power. Um, so yeah, we just need to get down and get everything set up. All right, so this is all filling up rather nicely. Uh, doing what we need it to do. Our limiting factor right now of filling this up any faster is this guy right here. Uh, I didn't even think about that. Um, we'll have to do some work and see about getting us actually you know what we could just go ahead and do it I, I was going to do some other stuff right quick but for now let's just go ahead and we want to get into the quantum entanglement porters these guys here these shouldn't be i mean they're going to be uh rough to make because we've got to do some refined obsidian uh but to get this we need the refined obsidian which is refined obsidian dust which is obsidian dust, which we need to get the enrichment chamber, which we have. We just need to get obsidian, which we should have. We did have some. I've got six. Uh, that might be enough for what we need to do. So uh let's get all this stuff together i've got to make we've got to get refined obsidian dust we're going to make that we've got to get a osmium compressor uh that's easy enough to do we've got the stuff for that um after that it's just more or less crafting some more of these alloys uh and yeah we've got everything we need so let's get that done all right so we're back uh, we've got these guys now made. Uh, that's going to give us more storage and it'll allow us to uh, store more power. Well, not store more, but transfer more power. So now I've got to make the climb back up to get this all hooked up. All right, so that's now set up. This is set. We've got it. Uh, set to power, got it set to auto eject and to output our energy. This guy will hold 102 million. Uh, I'm not sure if these are connected, if or if they both hold 102 million. Uh, so, but we, yeah, we've got a bunch of power storage right now. Our power for the time being is now taken care of. So, we do have a couple quests we need to complete. This guy here for the energy cube, that's just going to give us redstone dust. And this guy here for the Quantum Entangler Porter gives us another Quantum Entangler Porter, which is nice. I like that. Alright, so we're kind of at a point now to where don't really have a whole lot of time left. Uh, so we're going to make a few things. Um, we're going to work on, we're going to make an Energized Smelter. Let's get that up here. Uh, we're going to make a few of these machines that we need. Um, the precision sawmill, I'd like to have. That was not what I wanted to do. Um, and make any basic factory. That's just a thing. We can do that. And I think for the moment, that'll be what we need to do uh, so energized smelter let's let's look at this uh, we need need some more glass and I'm probably gonna have to get some glass a going 
Uh, we need to really just go ahead and smelt all of that. All right, so that's all done. We got everything we should need now to do this. So we've got the Energized Smelter. We'll go ahead and upgrade this guy to the Smelting Factory. That has us another quest complete. And we can go ahead and make our sawmill. I forgot to turn my phone down. And that'll be good enough. We don't need it for a whole lot of stuff. Uh, so, couple quests complete. Uh, this guy here, that's going to give us a basic tier installer. We can actually use that down here on our infusing factory. Beautiful. That guy is ready to go. It is now a better factory. Uh, we've got our sawmill. Uh, we need, we can just go ahead and put this guy here for now. And now we've got something better than our furnaces to use in order to smelt stuff. Um, so that is all the quests that we have done for the moment. Um, this guy here. Let's go ahead and make this pump. Uh, I'm trying to just find some pumps are nice. I like the pumps. Uh, let's get this guy. We need one of those. I need a bucket. And, boom, there we go. And we can take this guy here. Actually, we should be able to upgrade him now. That one, and that one, and we can get one of these guys, and we're going to have to change out this. And give it one of these in order for it to have power, and now we can go, I lost this. Now I can go down here and get lava the easy way instead of having to bucket all of it, which is nice. I come down through here earlier and had a crash. And I don't know what caused it. Uh, lava is one direction. This way. So we can put this guy down. We can put that guy there, and we can put our power cell out, set that to out, and we're getting lava. Oh, that's so much nicer. So much nicer. Alright, so now that we've got all of that, there is actually a couple things that we can make right quick. First things first. Let's make us a configurator. This shouldn't be that bad for us to make. We should have uh, enough stuff to do this. This guy here. Uh, I need sticks. And I need a lapis. And I see no sticks. Got all those trees out there. We've got no sticks. Uh, Alright. Or not all those. We've got all that out there and nothing in here. So there is us a configurator. Uh, that has no uh, reward for it. Uh, and then we can also get us another bucket. We can do that. And we can, I gotta, I need to do the thing. I've been meaning to want to do this. Uh, we need to put a lid over this. Alright, so now that that is squared away, I had to kill some mobs. Uh, we've got our mechanical pipes here. We can take our configurator, we need to get it some power. Uh, that'll work for the moment, just so we can get this done. Uh, we can set this to pull. 
and boom this guy is now ready to go I can just turn this thing loose and let it run without having to worry about anything all right so a couple more quick things while we are at it here uh, just to finish up a few mechanism quests that we've got going on first off we've got our cardboard box this guy is awesome uh, it could be used for several different purposes uh, we can use it to pick up chests but the most important one is we can use it to pick up spawners and move them without having to worry about having silk touch or anything else which is nice it's the whole point of wanting it so we've got that uh, we've actually got a quest up here complete that's going to that's for the mechanical pipe that's going to give us some more mechanical pipes that is lovely uh, there was one other thing else that I wanted to make what was it I don't remember Oh, we want to look at this. Uh, colors of the wind. Uh, this just more or less goes through the different colors for mechanism. Uh, gray, no input or output. Dark red, input for items. Dark blue, output. Green is power. Purple is secondary. And yellow is for fluids. Pretty standard stuff. Uh, we want to see about making a basic bin. These guys are nice storage but the storage drawers really are just better for that that is enough I think um, being this guy here we need two redstone and we can go ahead and craft this guy and this quest is out of the way uh, the biggest one uh, holds 262,000 items. This guy will... That's not what I wanted to do. That'll take forever to break. Um, we've got 144,000 in here right now. These will hold like 363,000 or something like that. It's way up there. Um, beautiful. Alright, so... But that is done. Um the chemical tank we can go ahead and make a chemical tank we're probably going to be using this next episode anyways one two three four and matter of fact we will make this and that's where we will call it basic chemical tank we're going to need like I said we're gonna need that anyways that didn't give us any kind of reward but it's alright we got a handful of mechanism stuff made today. We got a bunch of power stuff taken care of today. Uh, and we got a bunch of quests done. So, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!